I appreciate those songs you sang back there tonight, Brother David. Well, he made the God back there, Brother. God bless you. You know, the modern day church today, come on, has resorted to just giving in to giving up. I'm all being defeated. Yeah. It's over. Come on. It ain't gonna get better. Come on. Yeah. We we go by the we go by sight and not by faith, amen to God. We we look at the, the things in the carnal instead of the things in the word of God and trust right. his word, amen. Come on. True. You know, there was a time I can remember. Praise God next year. Hallelujah. It'll be 20 years that I've been serving Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord. I don't say that to glorify me. I say it to glorify Him that He's oh, kept me 20 right. years. Amen to God. Yeah, amen. And I've had battles along the way, but Jesus has sustained me. Amen. Kept me. Amen to God. Praise and I recall a time years ago to where you could not come into the house of God. Yeah. And you couldn't you couldn't hold people back from shouting the glory down. Come on. You couldn't stop them from testifying. Come on. I mean, when they say it's testimony service, yeah. Boy, you had people getting mad at each other wanting to testify for the glory of God. Come on. All right. And now look at this modern day church in 2012. Come on. And you do you have to beg people. Right. I mean, you have to. Does somebody want to say something for Jesus? Right. Come on. Oh. Anybody? Come on. Teeth. Come on yeah. now. Come on. Can I stop your toe and get you just to say something? Come on. Yeah. Hallelujah. I feel like sometimes you got to go and hit somebody to get them to say something. Come on. There is not a one of us in here tonight that's not going through something. Come on, yeah. brother. There's not a one of us in here tonight who's not been through something. Come on. Who's not yeah. got the victory, amen, to Come God. On. There's not a one of us in here tonight, praise God, yeah. that can't say Jesus has been faithful to us. Come on. Yeah. Because He has been faithful. Amen. Whether you want to believe or not, Jesus is faithful. He's an all-time God. Yes, yeah. He is. Yes. Always. I can remember years ago, I remember hearing Karen Wheaton sing this song years ago. Are you ready for a miracle? Yeah. Come on. And then the church would say, Yes, I am. Yeah. Well, how many tonight here at Voice of the Lord is ready to receive God's best? Amen. Come on. Amen. I mean, praise God. They said it earlier. Praise God. Weeping may endure for a night. Yeah. yeah. Just for a night. Come on. Come on now. How many's going through your night? Amen. Come on. Come on. You know that night is not going to last forever. Amen. Come on. Weeping may endure for a night. Just yeah. for a night. Yeah. Come on. But I got good news for you. <laughs> I got good gospel news. Come on, yeah. Come on. I got good gospel news. Oh, hallelujah. Joy. I said joy. joy. I said joy. joy. I said joy. Joy, joy, joy. joy. It's coming. It's coming. Yeah. It's coming. Oh. Joy is coming in the morning. Somebody look at your neighbor and say, Joy is coming. Joy is coming. Because he promised it. Amen. 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 Praise God. How many's ever woke up about 3 o'clock in the morning? 3 or 4 o'clock. You look outside, praise God, and you start to see a little bit of light coming in the dark. You say, man, I'll tell you, he not about that. Shut up, my God. I'll tell you tonight, I don't know who this is for, but light is coming to your darkness. Say, man, God. Light is coming. You've been down long enough. It's time to get up in the name of Jesus. It's time to start claiming back what the devil stole them. Praise God, here tonight I can give in to my woes and wees and bees and bees. Praise God. But I tell you tonight, I'm not going to let the devil take out of me what God oh, gives me. Hallelujah. hallelujah. I put my foot down and take authority over it in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Because my God is faithful. Amen. Because I know I got me a blessing coming my way very soon. Oh, Come on. Hell. Praise God. The hell I'm going through in my personal life, the oh. hell I've been going through financially, God's got me a big supernatural blessing on the way. Amen oh. to God. Yeah. And oh, it's going to glorify Jesus. Amen to God. And the hell you've been going through, yeah. you're going through. Amen. Come on. <laughs> well, Brother Mike, we don't need to preach like that because that's just not what we're used to hearing. Well, you know, when you live for Jesus... You're going through something. That's it. Come on. Because he did not say no word in that word. Now, in these modern day Bibles, they may say, Jesus said you'll live like a tiptoeing through the tulips. Come on, yeah. But praise God, nowhere I find in the King James Version Bible did Jesus say we would not go through something. Come on. Come on. Yeah. How many's ever gone through something? Amen. How many's going through something? Amen. But how many knows you're going through? Yeah. Come on, look Amen. at somebody other than your next door neighbor. Look at them opposite and say, I'm going through it with Jesus. I'm going through it with Jesus. 
Do you believe it? Yeah. yeah. Praise God. Oh, Somebody amen. give him a hand clap of praise. Amen. I got a word tonight. I hope it's going to be an encouraging word for you. Praise God. Yeah. Go with me to Psalm chapter 84. I'm going to be all over tonight in the Word. Praise God. I, I'm so thankful tonight that we've got liberty. I'm not, I'm not only talking about this natural liberty, but spiritual liberty. Right. We're free in Jesus tonight. Amen. Amen. Praise God, I tell you. I just wish the whole church could get that. Amen. I wish, praise God, that every, every place that's having service tonight or tomorrow night or whatever night they're having, I yeah. wish they could just let the spirit of liberty just have His way, which Come is on. Christ. Hallelujah to God. And just let Him just start moving amongst them. Amen to God. Setting people free from the old oh, bondages, old religious God. bondages. Glory to God. Praise God. I'm ready to start having signs, wonders, and miracles follow me around. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. He said they would follow you. Amen to God. I'm ready to start going places and the sick get healed. Amen to God. I'm ready to start going places and people, amen to God, being set free from the bondage they're in. Amen to God. I want to be like Simon Peter was and John. Hallelujah. When they walked by the lame man at the yeah. gate. They said, silver and gold have I none, but such as I have yeah. give thee in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Arise and walk. Arise and walk. That's what I want to start seeing happen. And it can happen, uh -huh. praise God. Because we've got the Holy Ghost in us, uh -huh. praise God, who is occupied in these temples. Hallelujah. He said, I go up so I can send the Comforter down. Yes. Yeah. His spirit, amen. Come on. Yeah. His spirit. Come on. Not a demon spirit. Right. Not a ghost. Holy spirit. Amen. His spirit, the Holy Spirit, amen right. to God. Or Holy, Holy Ghost. Holy we don't need ghost hunters, amen to God. Praise right. God. We don't need that old garbage. Praise God. We just need to have the Lord have His way. Yes. Amen. Praise God. How many has felt the presence of God tonight? Amen. Oh, and still Lord. feel His Thank presence, you. amen. Thank you, Lord. Psalm chapter 84 and verse 11. I love this verse. This is bringing some good news to you tonight. Praise God. Praise You've been down long enough. Listen to this. For the Lord God is a sun and shield. Hallelujah. The Lord will give grace and glory. Let me stop there. Aren't you glad He's a merciful God? Come on. Yeah. He's going to show you grace and glory every day. Praise God. Oh, this ought to get everybody here running the aisles. Hallelujah. Can we all read it together? Come on. The last part. Let's read it like we believe it. Amen. Yeah. No good thing will He withhold from them that walk uprightly. Oh, hallelujah. God, can we say it again? Praise God. No good thing will He withhold from them that walk uprightly. Praise God. Let me say it again. No good thing will He withhold from them that walk uprightly. Praise God. No good thing will He withhold from them that walk uprightly. How many is walking uprightly tonight? Amen. If you're walking uprightly, no good thing will He withhold from you. Go ahead. Somebody shout go ahead. No good thing will He withhold from them that walk uprightly. Amen. That's what I'm going to call my message tonight. Amen. Father, in the name of Jesus, name of Jesus. thank You, Lord. Hallelujah that You promised us no good thing would You withhold from us that walk uprightly. Father, thank You tonight for what we feel, Amen, and what we have experienced and what we're still feeling. Lord God, help us to just believe Your Word. Stand upon Your Word, for it's the final say, God. Lord, we pray You would touch everybody. Continue to touch them here in voice of the Lord. Those out there by Facebook and YouTube, Lord, minister to them mightily. In Jesus' <laughs> precious name. And the church said, Amen. 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 I'm going to be repetitious tonight, so y'all forgive me. But I'm going to say it again because I want you to get it in your spirit. Amen. Oh, right. No good thing. Yeah. Will He withhold from them right. that walk uprightly? Right. Praise amen. God. Let's just say it again. Amen. Praise God. Brother Mike, hallelujah. This is faith. Amen to God. I'm preaching the Word and it's going to build your faith. Amen to God. Faith cometh by hearing and hearing amen. by the Word of God. I guarantee you, Brother David, if you go over to them parks, praise God, amen. and you start walking around that park, amen to God, quoting the Word of God, praise God, no good thing for He withhold from them that walk uprightly. I'll tell you, you'll see a difference over there I tell you, the people in Owensboro will pray for those people that are going by shooting people. God, I pray whatever it takes, save their soul. Amen. Come on. God. Whatever it takes. Yeah. If it takes a car wreck to get them save in the hospital, they have to get them to reach save out to you. 
Let it be done. Praise God. I tell you, whatever it takes, praise God. I don't know why it takes tragedy to get people to finally look up to God. Amen to God. But sometimes it takes tragedy. Sometimes it takes something bad to happen for people to cry out to God. I don't know why it does, but it does. Hallelujah to God. But He will use whatever way it will take, praise God, to reach His people. Yeah. Yes, sir. Hallelujah yeah. to God. Somebody asked me the other day at work, Hallelujah. Let, let me just say this. God bless me with a brand new job. Go ahead, yeah. thank God. Yeah. Hallelujah. That night, Brother Billy got that word from the Lord. Praise God. It wasn't too many days after that. Praise yeah. God. I got it. Praise the Lord. That's God right there. Thank no God. good thing will He withhold from them. Yeah. They walk up right there. Yeah. Glory to God. Oh. You may say, Brother Mike, praise oh. God. I've been faithful to God. I've been serving God. But hallelujah, I haven't seen nothing good happen. No good thing will He withhold from you that walk Come up on. right yeah. now. Come on. Praise hallelujah. God. Hold on. Tell it. This tragedy we seen happen out in Colorado wow. with that guy who went in and shot all those people. Yeah. It's a tragedy, but I see a triumph coming. Amen? Come on. Wouldn't it be awesome? Hallelujah. And I'm like what Brother Billy said. I don't uphold what that boy did. Right. Yeah. What he did was wrong. Amen. It's a sin. They're right. But I tell you, if he repents, Come on. confesses his sin to God, yeah. and asks for forgiveness, he will be forgiven. Amen. Oh, yeah. Hallelujah. You can write me all you want to. And I know the families are hurting. Oh, yeah. right. I know that, hallelujah, that family that lost that little girl, that little four or five year old, I think she was. They're hurting. Come on. But God will all take right. this tragedy and turn it into trial. Come on. Yeah. Hallelujah. We just got to remain faithful through the bad times. Amen. Come on. I think about Job. Amen to God. How many remember the story of Job? Yeah. yeah. Job, hallelujah to God. Hey, man, I know God had enough confidence in Job that he would not rebuke him or curse him. Amen to God. Because the devil went before the Lord. He said, I can make Job curse you. Hallelujah. Oh, yeah. Quit serving him. Praise God. God said, you can do what you want, but kill him, Satan. Hallelujah to God. And you see Job remain faithful. Yeah. Even his hypocritical friends that came along the way wanted him just to give up. Come on. How many has got those hypocritical friends, if you will, that come have come on. your way and say, well, why don't you just quit serving God? Oh, yeah. yeah. Come on. Why don't you just give up? Amen yeah. to God. God don't do that healing stuff anymore in 2012. Yeah. I tell you, I disagree. God is still in the miracle working come business. On. God is still a healing God. Amen. What it is, we just quit believing. Yes, sir. The shape this nation's in today yeah. is because America won't repent. Amen. Yeah. If America would repent and turn back to God, yeah. God would heal this land. Amen. God would forgive this land. Yes. If the church, praise God, would ever get a backbone, praise yeah. God, and Come quit on. cowering down to the president Come and on. to the White House, yeah. to the, the government. Man. The on. government don't rule me, praise God. Jesus Christ rules me, Come amen, to God, right. and lives in me, hallelujah. And I'm not trying to be mean or anything, hallelujah to God. Yes, we live in a, land, in a land where we're free, amen, to God, because of the soldiers, amen, laying their lives down for us. But I'll tell you today, I don't pledge allegiance to the flag. I pledge allegiance to the Lamb, amen, Come to on. God. Amen. And His name is Jesus, amen. Yeah. Glory to God. I'm telling you today, the shape that this world is in is because the church is not getting back down seeking God. Amen. And if we sought Him, He would bless us like never before. Amen. Amen. The Bible Amen. says in John 10, 10, a very commonly used scripture, the thief cometh not, but for to kill, excuse me, for, for to steal, and to kill, and to destroy. Yeah. But I like this last part here. <clears throat> Jesus says, I am come. Have that they oh. might have life yeah. and, more and more miserably. No. 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 Uh oh, I didn't say that? Uh -uh. You sure? Yeah. Amen. I have come that they might have life yeah. and have it more wickedly. No. No, no. no? not that? No. Okay, Albert, let me try this again. Help me, Holy Ghost. What Bible you got? Boy. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Lord. He says, I have come, come on. that they might have life yeah. and have it more abundantly. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah
Hallelujah. Abundantly, praise God. Abundantly, praise God. You should be having peace in that day, man, to God, that time of the storm. Yeah. yeah. Praise God. Oh, Jesus Lord has come God. that come you might have life and have it more abundantly. Oh, well, come on, lift oh, your hands right now and receive of the Lord. Oh, amen to God. Lord, yeah. Lord, claim it. Oh, Thank you, Jesus. A more abundant life, amen, amen to God. Praise well, Brother Lord. Mike, you're getting off the lines on prosperity. No, I'm not. Yeah. I didn't say nothing about money. Come on. Come on. I said abundantly. Yeah. You'll have a life of joy. Come on. You can walk through a oh, crowd of grumpy people, yeah, praise yeah, God. Yeah. I'm telling you right now, you can walk around oh, the grumpiest oh, people, yeah. the saddest, oh, maddest, angriest people, and you can have a smile, praise oh, God. Yeah. No matter what the devil brings your way, you'll have a smile on your face, praise God, that oh. Jesus put there. Yeah, Hallelujah. Because yeah. when Jesus puts it there, it ain't going to go away. Come on. Woo! Come on. Glory to God. Praise God. For we know that the thief is the devil. Yeah. He comes to steal your joy. Yeah. He comes to steal, hallelujah to God, and tear down your family. Come on. Yes. He yeah. comes, praise God, to steal everything God has given you. Yeah. Right. He's coming to steal your children away so they won't serve Jesus. Come on. Right. He's coming to steal your wife away Come so on. you'll give up on God. On. Hallelujah. I'm preaching to me right now. Amen. Come on. Hallelujah. Come on. He's coming to steal your wife away Come so on. you'll go after somebody else. Come on. The devil has come to kill you. Right. See, Satan will come. I believe it's in 2 Corinthians, if I'm not mistaken. Oh. It says, He comes as an angel of light. Yeah. yeah. But that's when He's the dangerous. Oh, oh, yeah. See, we expect, I remember Brother Solis a year or two back saying, we expect the devil to come with the little pointy tail, come on. the little pitchfork, the yeah. little horns on his yeah. head, on. the little beard, yeah. the little red bodysuit. On. Only Brother Solis would say that. Yeah. Hallelujah. That's what he expects us to look for. Yeah. Yeah. See, the devil, he comes as that false doctrine. Come on, yeah. He comes as that legalism. Come on. To split the church. Yeah. yeah. He comes as that denominationalism. Yeah. To confuse the church. Come on. He comes as a different version of the Bible. Come on. To get your mind all warped up. Oh, yeah. See, praise God, I still believe, and I, and I want y'all to help me and agree with me if you believe this, I still believe we ought to stay with the King James Bible. Amen. 1611, amen. Come on. Come on. I believe we need to stay, praise God, with the Word and not corrupt it, praise Come God, on. and not allow the devil to corrupt it. Yeah. Come on. That's why there's so many churches today, they're confused. Yeah. It's bad when you go to a church service and, and, and the preacher will read from a King James, or it should be, and you've got half the people out there with NIVs, New American Standard Bibles, the Joel Osteen Bibles, the Benny Hinn Bibles, the yeah. Kenneth Copeland Bibles, the TBN Bibles. Yeah. Hallelujah. They put their name on it to sell it. That's all they're doing. Come on. God didn't give you authority to put your name on the Word to sell it so you can put it in your pocket, you That's devil. Right. Hallelujah. Tell it. I'm telling you today, the devil has come out to kill us. Oh, yeah. right. Praise God to, to pollute and corrupt the Word. Yes, to yeah. dilute it. Amen to God. Yes. How many of you ever drunk a oh, Pepsi yeah. or a Dr. Pepper or something? But you, you fixed it and you put your ice in it. You know, when you first pour it, it's fizzing. Yeah. But you let it sit there an hour. Uh -oh. Then you go back and you get that and you drink it. It doesn't taste like Pepsi oh, or man. Mountain Dew or whatever. Water now. It's watered down. Yeah. Right. You don't want that, do you? Oh. You want a nice drink, a fresh praise drink, God. praise God. Hallelujah. That's what the devil's doing with the word. Come he's on. watering it down Water little down. by little, yeah. amen to God. See, he started in the Garden of Eden. Right? Yeah. Telling them, well, if you eat of this fruit, yeah. you won't die. Yeah, you come on. You won't die. Yeah. Come How on. many's had the devil come to you and say, if you partake of this thing? Yeah. It's okay. Wow. You can you can if you work at a bank, you can take a little bit of money. No, Come you on. won't know it. Come well, on. Yeah. yeah. You you can you can stay off your, on your lunch break an extra five minutes more. Uh -oh. They won't say nothing. That's yeah. stealing. Come on. Come on. That's stealing. Come on. Man. Praise God. You cannot pay your tithes. Uh oh. Yeah. Well, you, you know you got to pay that that water bill so you can take a bath. Uh -oh. Yeah. I tell you, I'm at the point I'd rather stink in my body and make sure God gets His tithe. Come on. I believe, amen. praise God, because I don't want to curse, amen, to God. 
I don't want the enemy to have his way. Come on. But I know God's faithful. Amen. Yes, yes he, is. he is. He's faithful. Oh, I'm going back to that verse in Psalm 84. Yeah. The Lord will give grace and glory. Come on. No good thing will it be to hold them and they walk uprightly. Yeah. I got tongue tied yeah. there, but that's okay. No good thing Come will on. He withhold from you that walk upright. Yeah, that's good. Come on. No good thing. Right. Yeah, that's good. So your carnal mind, no matter what you think, no good thing Come will on. He withhold from you. God. Praise God. Just put your finger in your chest and say, Devil, tell the devil this. Say, Devil, devil. no good thing. No good thing. Well, Jesus, Jesus. withhold from me. Withhold from me. Because I'm walking upright. I'm walking upright. And if you're not walking uprightly, you better repent and ask God to Come forgive on. you. Amen? Right. Amen. It is God's will. <coughs> that you be blessed. Yeah. Come on. You're the head, not the tail. Right. Come on. See, praise God. Hallelujah. This is what we need to hear. Come on. See, we don't need to hear no more bad news. Lord, Lord forbid you turn on the TV, you hear enough of that. Yeah. That's right. You open the newspaper up and you read that Come garbage. On. Yeah. I do like one thing Smith Wigglesworth said. He said, I will not allow no newspaper in my home. Nothing that will glorify the devil is allowed in my home. All I want in my home is the Word of God. Amen. The Holy Word of God. Yeah. The Word of God that produces faith. Amen. Amen. Yeah. That brings healing. Praise God. That brings deliverance. Hallelujah oh, to the Lamb Lord of God. God. The Holy Word of God. Because yes. Psalm 119 declares, Thy Word is a lamp unto my feet. And a light unto my path. path. Amen. Yeah, amen. Glory to God. Yes. Some of you may have been here that night. I preach that message. Thy word is a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path. Yeah. See, we can't think we're going to get lost if we're believers. That's right. We got the word. That's yeah. it. So when it's dark, the word shines a light. Come on. Come on. Praise God. And then it's awesome. Then praise God, He's our path to walk yeah. on. Yeah. He's that straight and narrow path. Right. So we can't lose no matter what we do. Because if we let the Word lead us, yeah. we're going to win no matter what. Amen yeah. to God. Yeah. Somebody yeah. shout out. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Woo! Glory to God. Woo! Hallelujah. So I'm convinced tonight, praise God, yeah. that what God says is true. How many believe that? Amen? Amen. Amen. How many believe, praise God, you are more than a conqueror through Jesus Christ? Amen. 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 How many believes you are an overcomer through Christ and what Come He on. did at Calvary? Amen? Yes. Come on. How many believes, praise God, that we can stand still like Moses and the children of Israel and see the salvation of God? Because I tell you, we've been pushed to the edge. Right. But God is going to make a way. Come on. Amen. When there seems to be no way. My Lord, I tell you, I feel that in my spirit tonight. God is making a way. For each and every one of us, we're going through something where there seems to be no way. Amen. He's opening that sea, if you will. Yeah. Praise Amen. God. Stand to your feet with me tonight. Hallelujah. <coughs> Thank you, Lord. I told you I wasn't going to hold you long tonight. But I tell you, that, that's an encouraging word that we need. Amen. That's a good preaching. Yes. God wants to bless us. Yes, sir. No good thing will He withhold from them that walk uprightly. Amen? Amen. Oh. Right. No good thing will He withhold from you that walk uprightly. Amen. Right. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. What we need to do tonight and every night. See, it's good when we get together. See, that's why it's so important to gather together in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Yes. It's so good for us to come together because we draw off one another. Amen? Come on. Somebody may have had a bad day, but you may go to the house of God and yeah. somebody may sing, sing a song. Come on. Give a testimony. Yeah. And it may just rock <coughs> all man. It just may open those those curtains up, praise Amen. God, to the Son of God. Church. Amen. Come yeah. on. That's why we need to encourage one another. The Bible says, exhort one another. Yeah. yeah. Pray for one another. Amen. Right. And let's not forget this. Love one another. Amen. We forget that sometimes. Yes, sir. Yeah. And I tell you, one of the things today is that we need more than anything in the body is to love. Amen. Because I tell you, we can have the gifts of the Spirit flowing through here great. 
Yeah. We yeah. can see the dead be raised, the sick get healed, the blind see, the deaf, praise God, talk, the dumb, the dumb talk, the deaf to hear, amen? Yeah. yeah. But then there could be somebody in the midst of us. Remember like that Achan? Yeah. yeah. He partook of the accursed thing and hid it under his tent. Yeah. It caused the to lose the battle. Come on. Yeah. There could be somebody in the midst of us not loving one another. Right. Yeah. And we can miss out. Yes, we can. Yeah. So that's why it's important just to love one another. Let's not get jealous over come on. what God's doing for others. Yeah. I mean, come on, I'm gonna be honest, I've been there. Yeah. How many's ever been there? Yeah. You don't have to raise your hand if you don't want to. But I know how it is. I know how it is sometimes to have aught against your brother or sister. Yeah. But you know, you never have no peace until you make it right. Come on. Yeah. That's the truth. And you know you can't get no good thing from God because you're not walking uprightly. Amen. Come on. Come on. You have to let it all go and love yeah. as Jesus loves. Come on. Come on. And this word I'm going to say out there to those people in Colorado. Praise God. As bad as that tragedy was, and my heart goes out to every single one of them. Well, brother, I think Brother Billy said it earlier. We can't forget about that boy either. Come on. Because he's lost. Amen. He needs Jesus. Yeah, amen. And you know, Jesus would have died just for him. Yeah. Amen. That's right. Come on. I've said it before, praise God, about the 9 11 incident. Mm. Jesus would have died for all those Muslims. Yeah. We've got to pray yeah. for them, amen. Amen. Because they're deceived, they're lost. Come on. Right. So praise God, before before we leave tonight, I want you to go with somebody and just hug them and tell them you love them, really, mean it. And for something, praise God, that somebody needs, help them. Yeah, yeah. Amen. If they just need an encouraging word, Why? give it to them. Amen. 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 Father, thank you for your word tonight. Thank you for what... Hallelujah. Thank you for just moving amongst us tonight. Thank you for loving us, Lord God, when we were unlovable. All right. Thank you for giving us mercy, Lord, when we didn't even show mercy to others. Amen. Thank you that you're... Hallelujah. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Oh, God, I thank you that your mercies are anew each and every day, Lord. Yes. Oh. Thank you that you're great as thy faithfulness, Lord. Hallelujah. Come on. Thank you for all the things, Lord God, that we take for granted. But most importantly, thank you for saving us. Amen. For giving us yet another chance when we didn't deserve it. Amen. Thank you for everything, just the small things, Lord. Be with us, Lord, as we depart tonight. Get us to our home safely, Lord. Keep us safe. I plead the blood of Jesus over every home represented here tonight. In Jesus' name, amen.